One of the best parts of my day is what I call my first sip. The first sip is, is the first sip in the morning. It's led up to that point by opening the bag, grinding the coffee, boiling the water. What Stone Creek stands for is this idea of sip slowly. It's not just about that first sip in your kitchen, leaning against the counter with the light coming in the window. To me, the first sip is the sort of launching pad for the day and how we approach the day. Stone Creek Coffee is what you consider a specialty coffee roaster. You're committed to coffee that's above the majority of the coffee that's out there in terms of quality, so like the top 10% of quality. Just because a coffee tastes great doesn't mean that the story behind it is important or special. What we're building is a collection of stories. It's the story of a given farmer. It's my story. It's my barista's story. It's the story of every customer and their experiences with us. And through those stories, we, you know, ultimately we create lives. Stone Creek Coffee is committed to growing responsibly. By growing responsibly, we make sure that not only the coffee plants are taken care of and produce high quality coffee, but that producers are taking care of their own workers. The best part of traveling to Origin is meeting the farmers who grow our coffee. The pride, the care with which they tend to their coffee trees, the care and pride with which they harvest their coffee, the care and pride with which they process their coffee, sort their coffee, prepare it for us, is amazing. The first thing that we do when we get a green coffee sample is we need to sample roast that. And what that means is really pulling out and showing what's inside the coffee before we can put it onto production or before we even choose to buy that coffee. So what I do is I take it onto the little sample roaster and then I can put what's called a standard profile on it. I can really see and taste what's inside the coffee. And then I go and I cup the coffees. I taste it again to see if it's exactly what I had the first time. And if I like it, we'll buy that coffee. Chris is our production roaster. He prepares everything on a daily basis. He roasts about four to 5,000 pounds every single week. You don't want to drink the coffee fresh out of the roaster. It needs time to sit. So that's why we do the roasting the day before. If something's roasted at two in the afternoon on a Monday, it'll be bagged up at 10 a.m. on a Tuesday and the customer will be drinking it on Wednesday. So there's really only a day and a half to two days between roast to cup. I think coffee is an art and a science. Um, you really have to actually have passion for it, but also know all the sciences and you know, the reasons things do why they do. Full of perfect shot, it's a combination of a lot of things. You have to have uh, the perfect grind of coffee, you have to have the right blend of coffee beans to make a good espresso. And then you have to have the machine that'll actually do it for you. And so sort of lining up all those things is, is what really makes coffee great. It is really like a craft, like, um, you know, baking. You know, it's really about crafting those, like that single drink for a customer. You want to make it for that customer. It's made for them. And you want each drink to look amazing. I like that it's a locally owned company. It makes me very happy to support. I like the innovations that they've done, the space that they've reclaimed, and the way they've done it. I love walking into a Stone Creek coffee shop and just the feeling I get, just a very comforting feeling. I love the music and the attention that you know I get every time that I come into the place. They almost have the coffee ready for me, so it's the best thing. 
I've done a lot of research as far as from bean to cup and just the idea of how, how far Stone Creek takes it to, uh, to go out to the farms and to develop those relationships and to bring it to, to the customers is a very great story that they tell here. The moment someone steps into our store, what we're wanting to create for that customer is a break. And ultimately, I want them to have a great experience and get to know our baristas. And one of the things we work hard on at Stone Creek is having our baristas learn people's names. Because to me, when you know somebody's name, you're more connected to them. So we work hard to make sure we know your name, know your drink, and that we are that place where you can have a break.